Description box down below. Let's see what's going on in this cute, beautiful, angelic, happy, peaceful, precious shoe. Come on in. Hey guys, welcome to Maya's nursery. This is a nursery reveal, nursery tour. I might even do extra changes here and there, but we more or less done. Like, I've been changing up so many things. But so far, I'm happy with how it looks. And I had promised to share the final touches and the changes of everything. Let's see what's going on in this cute room chair. Oh, we are going to start by the cream where baby girl sleeps. So basically, what I've done with this bed is move it around five million times. I was not satisfied with how it was sitting. I was just not satisfied for a long time because the first time I actually got everything together for Maya's nursery, I had already given birth. The furniture hadn't been delivered yet. And there was just so much going on. So I did the nursery in a rush just to settle back from the hospital with baby. I think the nursery furniture got delivered the week of my birth, literally, because I was 37 weeks far ahead with my pregnancy. Didn't take as long as I had anticipated. But anyway, we moved and dream furniture was where I ordered all the furniture for Maya's nursery. So basically what I wanted was nude tones more than anything. Like I was like, no pink, girls, pink, so outdated. But you know, a touch of pink wouldn't hurt. So I ended up um, not having a problem with having that little touch of pink, even though I was like anti-pink at first. So basically, What's happening now, this is a sleigh cot that I got from Dream Furniture. They were so nice to sponsor me with a duvet set cover worth 5,013 Rand for every single piece that you see here that I've done up with the bed. It is customized. As you can see, these beautiful cushions have a Maya's name on it. Sweet Dreams Maya. They've just 
um, created this because this is what I wanted them to do and you can have any other word written on it the quality the linen feels so soft and fresh so 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 elegant I'm loving the vibes I love the extra cushions that it comes with there's this cushion and then also a small one there's this one and then also a smaller one that I feel she can use to sleep on. Luckily enough, we've started um, sleep training baby mims. She is currently seven months to sleep in her nursery. And what I like about this amazing duvet set is it has every single piece you would need from the bed cover, the fitted sheet, a beautiful thick cot bumper. You know, the little nuggets are so busy, especially at this stage moving around falling and like just you know being a baby so i like how thick this bumper is to protect her from like bumping her head on the actual cot there's a huge duvet set as well like that matches it's just so cute and i was in love with this pink gray white vibe more than the others but there's other options for you to choose baby boys are accommodated Everything, unisex colors, if you are a neutral kind of mommy. And yeah, I love it. It comes with this cute unicorn that Maya loves to drag and play with. Especially these three wool, wool, woolen, wool, wool, wool um, hair strands of the unicorn. It's very wobbly and flexible. Easy to be used for deco or just for baby to play and cuddle with. I'm obsessed with the Slaycott um, duvet cover set that Dream Furniture was kind enough to gift me and Maya with. So with the actual hardware, the actual furniture, I wanted something very like classic. So I went for the Slaycott. It is, you know, Slay, like, like, I can't even, let me just try to show you guys. This is what I want now. you guys can see this cut but it is a sleigh kind of shape which is like like you know a sleigh for horses yeah it's like that kind of shape it's like it's very elegant and classic this is a timeless cut i love how it's so thick i like the neutral tones of the sleigh cut i like the design i like the style i like the feel of the paint nice and smooth not rough it's all locally manufactured and designed. So I was just into this whole sleigh vibe. And yeah, it's just a cute sleigh cot that can also be turned into a toddler bed once baby girl gets bigger, which is like a convenient thing for every mom. Like something you can swap around for baby's growth spurts and use again at a later stage for the baby. And you can take the mattress slower and lower it it's just an everything in one kind of um cot bed cot so we are loving this now let's move to another part that i'm obsessed with i wanted the room to be a little personal make her feel like oh i know my family members so i had to play around with just a little bit of um, family photos and so this is the next side of the nursery and what I did here was have a little white side table had to make it personal for baby mums and have a little photo frame I love how the photo frame has gold framing on it to just match with the whole color coordination of the nursery I got a little planter and on the picture on the picture is me, Mercy and Baby Mims. Okay, so I needed it to be more personal for her with this um, whole setup here. And then because of the nude vibes that I did in the room, I had to go with the Pappas plant. I did want to plant in the room and a white vase. 
and then my favorite part of the room has to be the section oh my goodness so with the wall paneling it was so last minute i was working with Khalid interiors they had um wanted to collaborate with me so what they had done is do complimentary paneling for me and then obviously i'm using them for other interiors around the house because i love their work that much so basically what i wanted was something elegant light classic timeless in my room this is such a beautiful room one of my favorite places to be in the house so what um, the interiors did is extra wall paneling here in my room and i used the naming that i got from baby's emporium in waterfall corner personalized Maya's name also did this for the sister's room the frames are also from um the frames are also from baby emporium and a cute little unicorn painted and bambi this side matches so well with the well with the styling okay and and the paneling set up to match how nicely the frames and everything fit in it i love what Kaleeb interiors did with the wall paneling it is so beautiful so elegant goes well with the room goes well with the space goes well with the vibe i'm so obsessed with it and then over here we have the this rocker is so cozy so amazing i like how you can also rest your legs here you can move it to wherever you feel it's more comfortable for you but it is so amazing i had to go with the neutral tone the nude perfect for me because the main colors i was going for was nudes and whites but the pop of baby pink really really made it just girly in a nice way not vomit girly because that's not what i was trying to do so yeah the setup i liked how me moving the cot bed around created so much more space and made the nursery look so open everything is so cozy so comfortable and it's the best time here to feed my put her to sleep it's even nicer now since she's being sleep trained and sleeping in her own nursery i love this part this is also from dream furniture i will put all the details down in the description bar so the next section of the room is is this side of the um, paneling it's same vibe so um now we move it to this side of the room also moved on and dragged the wall paneling all the way to this wall i love what philip interiors did here it is so classic so elegant so i love that we could still add the same furnishing touches that we had before we did the change up. This unicorn is also from Baby Emporium, that waterfall corner. And then this frame, I was like, oh my God, there's a third frame. Where am I going to put it? And then it just seemed nicer to be here in one of the wall paneling blocks here, just under the unicorn. This is also from Kids Emporium. I had gotten the frames all together, three of them. And then this side, the sun shines right through in her room nicely. Did the blinds on both sides of her windows. This is blind guys. I um, got them on Instagram. I love how when you close everything, it like becomes an actual block out. You can't see anything outside but the light shining through, which is so nice. And then obviously if you see... If you want to see outside a little bit, you can just open it up like that. And then moving right along, this is actually inside. This is the toilet. It's just a normal toilet with her bathtub, her bathtub, her bath stand, and all that's in a toilet. I don't have to show you there. It's clean, but I just feel like it's not part of the tour. It's just a toilet. And then moving right along to this side this is okay so moving back this is baby girl's closet so everything is nicely set up here 
organized in its place and it's just full because babies just have so much they need like who would have thought that i would need this much for someone who's only seven months so this is her closet and i will show you all the extras with the closet so basically here is where i've placed all her shoes and then like just extras her nightlight just you know everything man clothes All her stuff right here, toys. Okay, so now this is my other cute corner that I created. So this is a shelf frame, also from Dream Fern. Same design, same wood as the cot. What I like is that one, two, and the cot all match with the nude cream white vibe cream white vibe so it's the same wooden design for the bookshelf the compactum and the sleigh cart i love 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 how this area is so cute i got all these books but by bird and i just kept i just kept putting them up here setting it up nicely so it just looks decent and has that kid feel to it. Made it personal with another frame of the three of us with Maya in my belly. We're in Cape Town on this trip, one of our favorite pictures, and it legit broke the internet. Like, for real. Everyone loved this photo shoot. It was super cute. And then most of the books I got from exclusive books. We are not going through the Ubi bin, which I also ordered from um, Kids, no, yeah, it's Kids, Baby Emporium, Kids Emporium in Waterfall Corner. And then let's move to the compactum side. So this compactum matches with the sleigh cart and the bookshelf. It's so pretty. Just elegant, classic vibes, you know, I love it here. And then I've always wanted this after I saw them on Cocoon. Online, I'm like, I'm definitely ordering this vibe for Maya. It's nude, brown, earthy, bohemian kind of vibe. So I like that little extra touch in um, her nursery. So this is from Cocoon with a matching Cocoon diaper um, storage. So I like obviously unstack her diapers from there and put them here. So um so this matches with the the the, the 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 changing mat both from cocoon and then another beautiful elegant piece is this timeless mirror reminds me of the sleigh cot in a way so it's also like a sleigh shaped vibe very classic very elegant and then all the drawers with all her extra stuff as i say babies have lots of things just as an end so here it's just mainly her things that i need to pack up that really don't fit her that much anymore it fit into some but not everything and then in this drawer is all her towels and her blankets and then here is all the extras the socks the beanies the bibs the cloths the baby carriers, more blankets, headbands, all the extra shebang. And then at the bottom is just extras. I'm not going to get into that. And then to this section of the nursery, um, this is another part that matches with the sleigh cart, the compactum and the shelf. So this is the storage, like an extra storage shelf. So what I had done here to organize it and not have it all over the place was have all her lotions, her brushes, her shampoos, earbuds, all the like things she uses on a daily right at the top. I'm obsessed with Mustela products. That's all I've been using for baby mims since birth. They are amazing. And then this section is 
more nappies and wipes and then right at the bottom there is all the medication the humidifiers the no sanctions i'll literally have to do a whole other video for my favorite baby items and products so yeah i think we've wrapped it up oh and one last thing before i forget is this um baby gym play gym that she can put when she's on the carpet sometimes when i'm changing her i can put it up there by the changing mat i like how it's so neutral and goes with the whole color vibe scheme of the room and then i forgot one last thing one last thing that i forgot i got this rug as well it's so nice and fluffy like it is the softest rug I've ever felt, like literally so soft. So I wanted a white rug, which I might end up putting still. I saw that they have these same rugs in white. By the time I ordered this one, there was no white. That they, now there's white, so I'm gonna put white. And then I think we might move this to maybe her sister's room. And obviously change it. I'm still gonna like, add and change and switch up. But more or less, this is the cute, nursery reveal i've been wanting to do so glad it's officially done and i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please do comment down below and give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to the channel child thank you love bugs Mwah.
Maya. Say hi. Say welcome back, Twazzy family. Say welcome back. So busy. Yo, she's at that stage where Upi is a girl. Hey. Hey. Can you relax? Yes. Can you relax? Can you turn it down a notch? Just a little, little, little bit. Okay, guys. So, yeah, it is all for today for the nursery reveal. I hope I covered everything I needed to cover. <laughs> I hope I shared all the details. I'm sure I did. But if I didn't, please do comment down below in the description bar so I can plug you with anything I didn't already plug you with. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please show it some love, all the love. Subscribe, you subscribe, subscribe. Oh yeah, what is mom saying? Please subscribe to the channel, please, if you already haven't. And, and what am I leaving now? Have yourselves a great day further. For me and baby Maya. Oh, baby Maya. You saying bye. Bye, guys. See you in the next video. I want to eat the whole baby chair. <laughs>